It's 6 p.m. content time. We have got multiple things being released right now. Hopefully, you've all had a wonderful weekend and hopefully you're having a great day as well. In terms of objectives, it does not look like we have got anything new right here. You have 24 hours left to do SAR if you do want to uh, complete that SBC uh, objective, sorry. But speaking of SBCs, today we have got... Da, 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 da. Sergio Ramos! Finally! Ramos has a sick card this FIFA. Coming in with five star skill moves. You absolutely love to see it. So now you've got the choice of Ramos, Kim Pembe, or Marquinhos. Obviously, incredible Nunmenj on the left, Hakimi on the right. The PSG backline, with a team of the Adonaruma behind them, is insane. So this card, uh, solid pace, ridiculous shooting for a centre-back, great passing, sick dribbling, great defending stats, and great physical stats as well. Um, power header trait, but yeah, five-star skill moves on Ramos. He does require four squads. What are they? Oh my goodness. 84 with an inform, an 85, an 86 with an inform, and an 88. That seems quite, um, quite expensive. I'm not going to lie. Uh, we'll quickly see if we can find what uh, what we're looking for here. Uh, in terms of finding out his price. We need a big boy SBC. I don't even know what else in the game has an 88 squad. Uh, Mateus, maybe? Mateus does. So it, just the 88 is 250k. Wow. Uh, an 86 with an inform is another 134. So that takes us up to 380-ish k. An 85... Takes us up by another 75k, so you're up to about 450k at that stage. And then an 84 with an inform. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how much that is, but we'll, we'll call it like 50k. It's about half a mil for this Ramos card. Now, that's a hell of a lot for a centre-back. However, he does look very good, and he looks like he'd be a hell of a lot of fun as well with five-star skills. So... I will end up doing this card, but it is expensive, so I wouldn't be surprised if some of you guys do not do it. Uh, foot 18, foot 19, both here. Uh, we also have... Ooh! Year in Review Player Pick is back, baby! The best thing that we've had this FIFA. Earn one of three players that were released exclusively through SBCs in Foot 22 up until Team of the Year. Um, you love to see it. That was absolutely incredible. So, I would really, really like to do this again. How expensive is it? It's an 85 with a team of the week. Okay, that's not outrageous, uh, to be honest. I'm not entirely sure what the best things are that you would get at this point, but it's not bad. Now, we have also got a mini release this is said mini release we have got ourselves a five star five star right midfield Jaden Sancho there were uh, leaks saying that he was going to be a left mid but turns out he is out as a right mid looks very good uh, and Sancho has suddenly gone for a player that no one really cares about on FIFA to Potentially one of the best wingers in the Prem slash the game. You've got a five-star skills Revich, which means that you can nearly build a... F well, you can build a full five-star skilling team in the Serie A other than a goalkeeper, which is madness. Uh, and he actually looks really good. And then you've got Lema, who is five-star skills as well who also looks like a baller. The amount of skill as this foot birthday rather than weak foot uh, boosts is amazing. 
absolutely amazing, and I massively, massively appreciate EA for making it fun and giving us all of these cards. The one thing that I ask is that we do get another goalie, please, so that we can actually link them to somebody. A soft link to anybody would be really, really nice. Now, I'm going to open up just a couple of packs as well. Uh, just to see if we can get anything to end it off. Uh, Mr. Payet, Defrel, Caruere, Martinez does not look like it. And then the last pack is... Nothing. Well, let me know. Are you going to be doing Ramos? Are you going to be getting any of the new mini-release players? Are you going to be doing the year and review pack? Because last time we did it, basically all of you guys seemed to uh, do it because we used them for a video and it was really, really enjoyable. So, yeah, I'm interested to know whether you guys think it's worth it. And if so, let me know who you get in the pack.